Hello YouTube, uh, this is Victor. Uh, you may be wondering who I am on Burns' channel. I am a neighbor of Burns, a good friend of him, and I moved to Australia four years ago. And uh, I become good friends with him. I uh, do not know many of his friends, but you know, I am a good friend with Burns. He uh, is a good man. Play a lot of sports together when we were younger, uh, in the street, you know. And he introduced me to uh, Xbox Live and Call of Duty, and uh, I've been playing since, uh, you know, Modern Warfare 2 is when he showed me, he said this game is amazing, I know he played much longer than Modern Warfare 2. And uh, today I want to talk about uh, the AK-47, my favorite personal rifle, uh, it is good Russian strong rifle, I tell you, it is uh, very durable, and I want to give you some history on the gun, but just quickly, uh, this is my gameplay on uh, his account when I was over at his house, I do not own Xbox, but uh, I do play uh, when I come over to his house sometimes. Uh, as you see, uh, all my kill streaks and the gun and all that stuff is around the side, it's very nice, very pretty, like good Russian woman, and uh, you may not be able to see very clearly uh, at the gun stats, but basically, uh, the gun is a 4030, so after about, uh, I would say, f 12 to 13 meters, it drops to 30. And uh, that is with silencer, of course. After 12 meters, it drops to a uh, 4 shot kill. But uh, if you do not have silencer, then it will take to about 35, m no, a bit more, 37 meters until. Uh, you know, the gun gets weaker, so it is 3 shot kill. It is very good gun, as you can see, he's a uh, close range combat, and it will be a uh, 3 shot kill, so very good. But uh, I, I give you some history about the gun. Uh, the AK 47 is a selective fire gas operated 7.62 times 39mm assault rifle, first developed by the uh, Soviet Union by Mikhail Kalishnikov. He's officially known as Avtomat Kalishnikova. It is also known as Kalishnikov, an AK, or in Russian slang, Kalash. Uh, design work on the AK-47 began in the last year of World War II, 1945, and after the war in 1946, the AK-46 was presented for official military trials. Uh, in 1947, however, the fixed stock version was introduced into service with select units of the Soviet Army. An early development of the design was the AKS, which uh, stands for Skladnoid or folding, which was equipped with a underfolding metal shoulder stock, and in 1949 the AK-47 was officially accepted by the Soviet Armed Forces and used by a majority of the member states of the Warsaw Pact. The original AK-47 was one of the first true assault rifles to be manufactured after the Sturm Gewehr 44. This is a STG-44, shitty uh, German. It's terrible, I hate the Germans, but uh, terrible German assault rifle that was first ever made. But of course we make better because we Russians, we always better than Germans. And uh, even after six decades, the model and its variants remain the most widely used and popular assault rifles in all of world because of their durability, low production cost and ease of use. It has been manufactured in many countries and has seen arm seen service sorry, with armed forces, as well as revolutionary and terrorist organizations worldwide, such as uh, Al-Qaeda, etc. The AK-47 was the basis for developing many other types of individual, individual and crew service firearms. Sorry, my English is terrible. Uh, more AK-type rifles have been produced than all other assault rifles combined, so you know, you have a uh, AK-74U, lots of different variants. You have uh, AK-47, AKS, RPK, AKM, AK-74, etc. KSK shotgun, just to name a few. But basically, it fires the 7.62 times 39 mm cartridge, and the AK produces significant wounding effects when the projectile tumbles, tumbles and fragments in its tissue but it produces relatively minor wounds when the projectile exits the body before beginning to yaw, so you know, you want to shoot a few times with this uh, strong gun. And basically it is a assault rifle from Soviet Union, as I said, 
Uh, it's been in service since 1949 to present, so it's very old gun, but still a wonderful gun. Uh, last, you know, well over 60, just over 60 years now, and uh, very good. So it was designed, as I said previously, by Mikhail Kalashnikov, uh, designed in 1944 to 1947, hence the AK-47, and manufactured is Izmash, but uh, this is something I want to tell you. Not many people know this about the gun, because, you know, they play a game and they just think, oh, I want to kill people, they don't think about uh, the beauty of the gun, but this gun has sold approximately 75 million AK-47, and a hundred million AK type rifles, so a hundred million is the variance I uh, previously stated as uh, AKS, RPK, 74U, etc. And it is very, very good gun. This is effective. Uh, the semi automatic version is effective up to 400 meters or 440 yards, and the effective range of the fully automatic is 300 meters or 330 yards. Because, you know, when they design these guns, they do not want, uh, you know, beach uh, one-shot uh, bolt-action rifle back in those days, you know. This was one of the first ever built, so back then they only had uh, bolt-action rifles such as Mosin Legant or shitty uh, German K. Stupid Germans, but, uh, you know, this gun, it is very good for up to about 300 to 400 meters, very good. And uh, just to give you some design background, I'll tell you, um, design during World War II, the Germans first pioneered the assault rifle concept, based upon research that showed that most firefights happen at close range, within approximately 300 meters, so they, didn't, they do not need bolt-action rifle. Uh, very stupid, they basically, uh, it took them a while to figure out what they really wanted, which was good, strong assault rifle like AK-47. Now the pattern range of contemporary rifle cartridges was excessive for most small f small arm firefights. Sorry, my English terrible. I've only been in Australia four years, so I only learned English for four years. Still not very good as I moved here from Russia not long ago. But sorry, uh, you'll have to excuse me as I keep, re keep reading uh, uh, some information for you. Uh, as a result, army sort of cartridge and rifle combining submachine gun features such as you know large capacity magazine selective fire but they still want intermediate power cartridge effective to 300 meters so you know they want uh, a mixture of bolt action rifle and submachine gun they wanted to shoot quick fast they still wanted to be powerful now first the germans they were the first to make the Sturmgewehr 44 stg4 t4 as i said before but you know this gun is still it is still bitch compared to the wonderful AK-47 that Mikhail Kalashnikov uh, began to create. And interesting enough, he created it as a weapon designer whilst he was in hospital. Uh, he was shot during the Battle of Bryansk. And after tinkering with the design, he entered a competition for a new weapon that would chamber the 7.62 times 41mm cartridge. And that ended up being... Uh, taken out for the 7.62 times 3 point, sorry, 39 millimeter cartridge, which we use now. And so yes, uh, basically the rest is history, <laughs> as you can uh, see. Good pun there. And uh, this gun is wonderful. It has been in Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare 2, and Call of Duty Black Ops. It is now in Modern Warfare 3, one of the most popular guns uh, ever made. And it is the only rifle that has been around that hasn't been changed pretty much. You see, M16 had been changed from M16 to M16A4 in Modern Warfare 2 and then back to M16. And, uh, you know, uh, the MP5 was just MP5 in COD 4, but then changed to MP5K in Modern Warfare 2. And then in Black Ops, they changed the look of the MP5K, a uh, shitty German gun. But uh, that is it, 48 and 4, my friends, I get two captures, very good, pretty good player, Burns, he says, and he wanted me to go on the channel. Uh, if you would like to see more of these gun guides, I will uh, make them, but Burns, he said, I'm only allowed to return if uh, there's enough likes and favorites on the video, so if you want me to return, please, I beg you to uh, like and favorite the video, and uh, good objective play, as you can see. Other than that, I will see you all later. Uh, hopefully, uh, 
want to see you. So please like and favorite video. And uh, das will dann hier.